Hello, I'm Joyce, your Cat Fit Studio Trainer. Um, we are going to begin with a super practical, effective ab workout that you can do at the beginning or ending of any workout. We're going to sculpt every bit of your core. So we're going to begin with a quick warm up. These are called forearm plank seesaws. So coming, bringing your forearms to the mat, making sure your elbows are directly underneath your shoulders. We're gonna curl the toes under and we're gonna press forward and back for 30 seconds. 29, 28, 27, 26. Pulling that core in, keeping the head in line with the spine. It's 19. 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And hold it here. We're going to dip the right hip to the right. Touch the mat and then to the left. It's three, four. Again, pulling that core in. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good. Draw the knees to the mat. Press it on back. We're going to begin with star sit ups. We're going to bring our legs high up to the sky. Hands behind the head, and as you crunch up, your legs are going to part. Okay, so we have 20 of these. Here we go. 20, 19, 18. Making sure you're breathing on the up. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, not to pull on the head, 5, 4, 3, keeping the elbows nice and wide, 2, and 1. Now keeping those shoulders raised, hands together in between the legs. We're going to pulse it here for 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Drop it down. Extend the arms and legs out for just one moment. Taking an inhale. Taking an exhale. We're going to again extend the legs up to the sky. Hands behind the head. We're going to drop the left leg. We're going to twist to the left, and then we're going to twist to the right, bringing our elbow to our knee. We have 30 of these. Here we go. So dropping the right leg, here we go. 30, 29, 28, 27, 26. Notice how I'm rolling across my shoulder blades. 22, 21, it's 20. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, elbows nice and wide, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Bringing that right leg down, we're going to bring the hands together and we're going to pulse it here, hover that right foot palms together. Here we go. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And switch it up. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Drop it down. Extend the arms and the legs all the way out. Take an inhale, take an exhale. 
We're gonna lift into a reverse tabletop. We're gonna press the palms into the thighs. So you want this resistance of the leg, the, the uh, thigh pressing into the palms of the hand. So it's really a, a very dynamic uh, ab workout. So bringing the hands to the top of the thighs, lifting the shoulders, press, press into the, press into the palms of your hands for 25. Here we go, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Drop it down. Extend the arms and the legs all the way out. Taking an inhale, taking an exhale. And so, Next exercise, we're gonna drop the right leg to a hover. We're gonna twist left. And as we're twisting, we're holding one side. And we're gonna pulse the right leg up for 25 seconds. Here we go. 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. Switch it out to the right. Here we go. 25, 24, 23. Pulsing that left leg. 20. It's 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Drawing that elbow to the knee. It's 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Drop it down. Extend the arms out, extend the legs out. Take an inhale, take an exhale. Okay, now we're bringing the palms of our hands to the mat, setting it just below our bum. So we're gonna support that lower back. Um, we're going to hover our legs up, maybe an inch off the mat, draw the shoulders up, and we've got 70, crisscross, making sure you can see me. 70 crisscross, cross right, cross left. Okay, here we go. Lift it up, here we go. 70. 60. 40. 20. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, relax the head, 5, 4, 3, 2, don't you drop those feet, we're going to flutter it for 15, 15, 14, up and down, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, come on, make it count, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, drop it down, extend the arms out, you get your heart rate up just a little bit during this. Extend the legs out. Taking an inhale and an exhale. Our last exercise is going to be a knee tuck hip lift. And I'll demonstrate it first. So we're going to come down to our backs. We have 30 of these. So our hands are flat on the mat. We're going to knee tuck and hip lift. Okay, so when you are, we're gonna press out and hip lift. Now let me give you just a little bit of uh, uh, discussion on this. We want our lower back to stay flat on the mat. So when you are lifting, pressing out, if that lower back comes up, you need to be pressing out here because we always wanna keep that lower back grounded. And today I'm gonna be doing it, this slight modification. And as you get stronger in your abs, you can lower and press out more with the legs. Here we go, we have 30 of these. Here we go, so in and press. Up and press. It's three, four, five, six. We 
We have 30, 7, 8, 9, and 10. 20 more. It's 20. These are effective. 19, 18, working our whole core. 17, 16, come on, 15, press it out. 14, press it out. 13, breathing. 12, 11, it's 10. We're in the home stretch. 9, 8, yes, we're almost there. 7, press, 6, press, it's 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. You did it. Extend the arms out nice and long. Legs out nice and long. Like I said, this is a 10 minute total core workout. Draw the knees into the chest. Hug the knees in. And again, extend the arms out. And we're going to roll up one vertebrae at a time to stretch it out. So we're going to extend, coming to our left side, and bringing the hand right here underneath the shoulder. We're going to lift up, extend through that side body, getting a nice stretch here. And other side, doing this workout anytime. My husband and I are scuba divers and we have been on boats for a month at a time. I have done this workout daily and it's really made a difference. So it's just 10 minutes and come down, coming to our bellies. We're gonna bring our hands to our chest right on either side of the chest. The top of the feet are on the mat and we're gonna gently press up and opening that chest, smiling, knowing that you just did an amazing workout and bringing the toes of the feet together, extending the hands out wide Legged child's pose, drawing the forehead to the mat. Breathing. And walking the hands in. And thank you. Namaste.